don't talk back to me in my own damn kitchen, you damn pig. Holy cow, you're a psychopath. Are you planning on being a semi-decent cook? You have no conceivable reason to be scared of something like a stove. You get burnt and you keep cooking. If you can't follow simple safety regulations, it'll be your own damn fault. Yes, yes, chef. Please don't burn off my face. I couldn't hear you. Yes, yes, chef. Warning, this game is work of fiction. There may be contents of graphic death, blood, gore and violence, and some other crap. We're gonna do the tutorial. Because I have no clue what in the world I am doing. This is a very interesting art style. Oh, wow. You actually showed up for training. On time, too. Barely. This is a highly sought after position. Be grateful you're even getting the benefit of being told how to do your job. Your resume showed many, many jobs in the service industry, so I assume you already have some of this down. Though I'm choosing to ignore the rate at which you got new positions. Hey, having 28 service industry jobs over the course of 7 years is pretty impressive when you think about it. I got fired from absolutely every damn one of them. And even less impressive when you think about it for 5 seconds more than that. But with those jobs, you likely already know how to seek customers. Go to the counter and get them the appropriate table. Keep in mind how many people are dining. You don't want a large group crowding around a private area. If I actually have to worry about this, I am a uh, super boned. He's gonna be losing another job. Table for two, please. See them there, yeah? Good job. Now well, take a moment to see what we're serving today. Once they're ready, they'll put their menu down and you'll go check in on them. What what are we serving today? Yeah, patrons don't pick what they eat and say we have a strict menu that changes daily. You know that if you had read the interview, we are rather upscale and rather pretentious. I uh I skimmed it. I'd like an appetizer. Once you have their meal ticket. Bring it to the marker between the window and the door, and that'll send it to the kitchen. The cooks will start work on whatever order you have right away. Keep in mind, they prioritize cooking the dessert, side meal, and appetizer in that order. Hold up. Dessert, side, meal, appetizer in that- that sounds really backwards. Don't pass or distracting the cooks if it's taking too long. Oh, I'm gonna be so bad at this. Here, take your damn food. Once they're done with the appetizer, they'll ask for more. Once you go back over, don't keep them waiting long. I'm washing you... Like a hawk. Your need and every whim shall be met. I'd like a main. I'd like a main. I... I hope the main is good. Can I pick up two main dishes? I can only hold one dish. I'm a terrible server. Thank you. Can I bust your table? Or do we just leave the plates there? <laughs> Once they're ready for the bill, go behind the counter to check them out. Yes, sir. Whatever you say. Here's your money. You've earned 200 euros? Pounds? Most customers will ask for the full course of appetizers, sides, meal, and desserts. Once they're done with their meal, make sure to clean their table. I don't want guests thinking we leave messes out in the open. I mean, I also normally bust a table as you... Can I really not select it from that side? Are you not able to clean the table? If that's the case, the trash is probably full. Come back to the kitchen to check. The garbage will be right... Oh, to the right of the back door. Okay. Ugh, seems like it is. If you can't clean a table, then it means there's nowhere for the scraps to go. Take the trash and bring it out to the alley behind the kitchen to throw it out. Oh, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. It's gonna be brutal. I'm here for the ooky spookies, but somehow I'm in the service industry. The most terrifying thing of all. There's nothing more scary than having to wait tables. I'll let you take this next customer on your own. Hello, welcome. Where we serve you and your friends and family in more ways than one. Table for one. Yes, sir. I'm gonna sit you right the hell here. So we have like tables for two. I'd like an appetizer. Okay. Easy peasy. 
Makes sense. I'm gonna be the greatest waiter of all time. Here you go, sir. And I'll be here. If you need anything. Yes, do you have to go to boxes or a way to order ahead of time by any chance? Uh, no we don't. Oh, thanks for letting me know. Good work. Though, try to keep tone in mind, too. I don't want customers thinking our service is anything less than professional. But, but I'm not a professional. Exactly. I'm still here. Is there anything I can do for you? Legal? Illegal? Moral? Immoral? I'd like a main. Oh, yes, I can. I can also just get food for you. This is taking forever, I'm leaving. What the hell? Ugh, did that one leave? They were probably expecting fast food level speed anyways. We wouldn't want them coming here. The good news is they still have to pay for what meals they did eat. But in the off chance a respectable customer loses their patience and leave, they likely won't be leaving any tips and won't be paying for any future meals. It's in your best interest to not let that happen. Or I'll be serving you up next, young man. That did leave you with a dead plate. Unless another table wants that exact order, you're stuck with it until you throw it away. Perfectly good meal. Gone to waste. Bring it back to the trash can. Okay. If I keep doing dead plates, will you just turn me into a dead plate? Good work. Some other things may come up, for, but for now, you seem prepared enough. We'll be opening in just a moment. Are you all set? I am ready to be the greatest server to ever live. Now that you've probably trained in, you're ready to start actually working. Here's our menu for the day. Appetizer, main, side, and a dessert. Well, I feel like that's our menu every frickin' day. If you need me, I'll be in the back. Good luck. I'm terrified. I'm not emotionally prepared for this. Hello, welcome, welcome. Table for two, please. What? Oh, I'm just I'm clicking too fast. Help me be of service. I'd like an appetizer. I'd like an appetizer. Okay, uh, assumingly that everyone's gonna want that first. Come on. Oh no. I'm already getting to feel the stress. Run! Run, you fool. Hello. Table for one, please. You seem like you're gonna dine and dash. I'd like a main. Yes. I'd like a main. I'd like an appetizer. Okay, that's two mains. Damn, enjoy your food. Savor it a little. You just fucking inhale everything. I'd like a side. I'd like a side. I have a freaking panic attack. And this is just a game. I could never do this in real life. Come on, come on. Come on, click him before he gets angry. Oh my god. Please, just, just for a damn moment. Enjoy your food. My god. Oh my god, this is stressful. <clears throat> There's only three customers. What happens when I have a restaurant full? I'm gonna have a freaking stroke. Thank you. Thank you. Oh shit. When they prepare that, I'll bust this damn table. Alright, alright, we're cooking. We're doing good. It was only three customers. And I was already on the verge of tears. Here's your money. You've earned green onion rolls. Am I being paid in food? Oh, come on, man. You gotta clean up a little bit. Do you play guitar? Let's grab some pieces of love letters and lyrics you wrote for. I should, I should really finish up writing some of these. Let's, can we clean? I'll get to it later. Someday, wash the, wash the dishes. Oh, that bread. 
first time I ever making how do you burn the oven making cereal? How do you burn them? A horse. Well, it's a bike, but you treat it like a horse every time you go to work with it. What about the trash? Can I clean up the trash? Call her? No. I'm not calling my ex all desperate like. An exclusive interview with Chef Vincent Charbonneau. The owner of, uh, I can't pronounce that. Oh boy. I'm so excited to be here. The most expensive thing in this apartment. Some parts of the screen are cracked. You can still make out the images. Does it want me to call her or can I just go to bed? Look out the window. Does this do anything for me? I'm just gonna go to bed. Oh, I just... I have to know. Call her. That's a long ass number. Ring, ring. Uh, I, I guess she's busy. Or she just doesn't want to... I mean, I guess you don't have color ID. Let's end the day. Wait, 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 wait a minute. I, I, I get roller skates? I want a... Perfume? Cologne? So, sorry, I'm late. So, sorry? Sorry doesn't cut it. It's only your second day and you're already... Why do you look like that? I, uh, I thought biking was really faster than rain would dry me as I go, but turns out it just soaks me faster. Yeah, dry off. You can't be seen by customers looking like this. You do know umbrellas exist for a reason, yes? I, I don't own one. I'm giving you mine for the ride back so this doesn't happen again. Oh, this is a, a, an adorable dynamic. Oh, uh, thanks. <laughs> then how are you going to be getting home without one? I live here. Like, like in the restaurant? My apartment's upstairs. Oh, yeah, that, that makes a lot more sense. Wow. Is there a problem? Nah, it's just... Isn't that worrying? Like, if something happens to the building, it's all gonna be gone. If you have enough time to talk nonsense, then you're ready for work. Appetizer, main, side, dessert. Meow. I eagerly await your patronage. Table for two, please. Come on, I want to see them here. Meow. Oh, they're fast. They're like an appetizer. Oh my god, piss off. I only handle two at a time, go away. Table for- oh god. No, not table for two. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I hope they have patience. Oh god, I hope they have patience. Wait on a cotton pick in second! God damn it. I'm like a man. I'm like a man. Oh god, this is atrocious. I hate this. This is so stressful. How do you do this as a living? I, uh... I'm panicking. Like a main... A main... You can wait a cotton pick in second, old man. Yes, you'd like a side, I know this. I'm aware you'd like a side. You'd all like sides. You all eat like you've never eaten before. This is stressful. I'm gonna say that a hundred more times. Yes, I'm aware you'd like a side. Shut up. Thank you. Thank you for your patronage. Trash can's full. Oh my god. We just started the shift. How was the trash can full? You are setting me up for failure! You've earned 400 euros and or pounds, I don't know which... I even took out the trash before I left, how is there more trash? What do you people do at night? You've earned blueberry crepes. 
I wonder if I can burn these in the microwave. It's a possibility. So do we like desperately call her again? I should just stick to take out or something. You're gonna starve to death. I guess we're just gonna look out the window. I mean, it's there for a reason. Should we try calling our long lost love again? Hello, hello, I'm desperate. I'm lonely, please call me back. Answer the phone. I guess she's dizzy. Probably with my brother. I'm about to start adding lore to this story. All right, let's freaking start day three. Another day in paradise. And now, you can see here as my soul leaves my body. Table for four, please. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh no, I'm not ready. I'd like an appetizer. Oh, they just do it as one. Okay, that's actually extremely convenient. Hello, hello, welcome. How many appetizers have I given them? I can't remember. That's all of them. Okay, cool. Here you go, sir. I apologize for the long wait. I have a bunch of people over here. Come on. Come on. Is he gonna be faster? We'd like a main. Okay, I figured you would. I apologize, sir. I have to beat all these fuckers over here first. I'm going to be the first. Ever. Ever. The fucking trash is full. What? Ow! Oh, I'm, I'm, oh, dang it. I'm sorry, there's something in the trash. I think I may have ripped the bag open when I dropped it. I think it cut me. I swear I didn't throw away anything. I wasn't supposed to. I don't, I don't think. I can clean up the mess. I'll just need a second. Oh, Jesus, why? You don't need to worry about that. Someone else will get the mess. Let me see your hand. Why did you slap the shit out of him? You can't be serving the customers with this. Try to be more careful next time. Did you slap him like calm him down? You can't just slap people like that. Oh man, I really need to be able to carry more plates. I know you're waiting on more orders. I'm sorry. Please don't be disappointed in me. There's already enough people disappointed in me. No dead plates. Perfect. Run! I stand here. I lay eagerly awaiting your orders. Sirs and or madams and or other. Be pleased with me. Here's your money. You've earned 800 pounds or euros or something or other. Can you, can you please tell me why you slap the shit on me now? You've earned squid ink pasta with shrimp. I don't... I know what squidding tastes like. When do we get to the freaky deaky? Please, for the love of God, don't burn it. He ended up burning them. I just took out, took out something. Oh, can I actually eat some of this stuff? The freezer is empty. I can't eat anything here or drink any of the beer. I just have delicious meals chilling out while I starve to death. Follow her, so eventually she'll call the police on me for harassment. Guess what? She's fucking busy. I guess she's busy. Oh my god. I wonder what I see outside of the window. Not a diddly damn thing. Your body starts feeling itchy? Press Z to try and scratch. Oh, I can scratch like I'm an offer. Not enough. Keep going. Are those like bisecting? Oh, those were like the lines that you see on like the freaking cow charts or the pork charts. I can equip. Absolutely. I should probably be checking the magazines. Day four. Here we go. I don't want to go and work anymore. Hello, welcome, get the hell out. Table for two, please. Yes, madam, I shall sit you right up here, close to the window, so I don't have to run as much. Do 
He would both like appetizers, I assume. One moment. Table for four, of course. A table for four. How unhelpful. Man, why can you not carry more than one plate? You'd like an appetizer. Of course you would. I goofed this. Hang on, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Look, I'm putting you all behind the A-Paul. I'm sorry. But I know if I don't do this, I'm going to end up boned. How did I end up with it? Who the hell do you think you are? Huh? I, I apologize, Chef. A sorry doesn't fucking cut it now, does it? Do you think a dish like this at all is acceptable in my kitchen? No, Chef. Then why did you make it? I, I don't know, Chef. I must have... You don't know? It, it slipped my mind. I apologize, Chef. Some flour had been left near the stove and I didn't want to get burnt. Don't talk back to me in my own damn kitchen, you damn pig. Holy cow, you're a psychopath. Are you planning on being a semi-decent cook? You have no conceivable reason to be scared of something like a stove. You get burnt and you keep cooking. If you can't follow simple safety regulations, it'll be your own damn fault. Yes, yes, Chef. Please don't burn off my face. I couldn't hear you. Yes, yes, Chef. I need a break. Get the hell back to work. Okay, then. Oh, man, this is a bitch. Do I handle the smaller tables or the bigger tables? I, I have no idea how to do this. I feel like... I don't know, I feel like you prioritize the bigger tables. No, the smaller tables, I guess. Bigger tables would expect to, like, not get as much as quickly. So they'd be more inclined to be patient. Supposedly, I'm most, I feel like most people in this who go to restaurants are just not patient in general. Even as a customer at restaurants, I've just seen the worst interactions between people. Because they expect just absolute perfection out of other human beings, and it's kind of despicable. I need to toss that. What's up, Broski? Hey, Vince. What do you want? Do you like your job? I've dedicated my life into making this bistro as successful as it is now. Yeah, but, but do you like it? What do you mean by that? Well, for some reason, someone who claims they're proud of owner of this restaurant, I don't think you've actually... You know, seen you cook? Uh, huh? What about you? Me? I mean, it pays, it pays me money, boss. What did you want to do before this, then? I doubt you wanted to wait tables for a living. Well, I, uh, I guess was studying for in school for something for a bit. Oh, what are you going there for? You're definitely going to make fun of me if I told you. You don't need to be worried about that. It can't be any more embarrassing than yes, you are now. Yeah, you see, that kind of talk is exactly what I mean. And what? What do you care if you're single? Hello, neighbors. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Hello? May I take order? Will you hurry up? We'd like a dessert. You don't say, since it's the only freaking thing left on the menu. You are so useless that you cannot carry two plates at once, even. Yes, yeah, so allow me to tote one item to a table at a time. If that happened at an actual restaurant, people would lose their minds. I now shall wait here. Equally awaiting your every command. Anything. And I mean anything. Thank you for your patronage to get the hell out. Oh yay, more food stuff that's gonna rot in my damn fridge. 
Oh, did I actually eat this one? Or do I have to burn it first? Why would you microwave cheesecake? You end up burning them. Oh, I can buy things now. Strike matches for a variety of consistent strong flames with compact and discreet packaging with a variety of luxuries for the modern world such as matches, wallets, lighters, aftershave, and more. Don't deny yourself opulence in your everyday amenities. Oh, I can upgrade this crap? When Chef Chabonneau opened his innovative restaurant, La Croissance de Saturn, and had grown to steady success among older, more classically refined patrons. However, after six years of its opening, it's remained a modern dining location despite many initial concerns. Of its monthly rotation and strict menu growing stale, as a form of contemporary dining despite the dining experience staying consistent, critics have recently noticed a drastic shift in employee numbers. Asked about these changes, I've prided my location not only on what I can personally bring to the table, but on the talent and something or other my co my workers can provide. I asked what his something process of maintaining the bistro's well-known standards was like with a noticeable low em of employee numbers. Not only do my customers deserve good service, but my staff deserves a job where they can be best utilized and their efforts won't be put to waste. My hiring process reflects that. Alright, we're gonna get the skates. We're gonna get the cologne. We're going to... Uh, tip jar. Hello, darling. I've missed you so. Oh, I guess she's busy. Lie on the couch. Save the game. Lie on the couch. Still nothing out the window. Yep, nothing out the window. When does the good good hit? Oh. I'm sorry? Why? Why can't I press Z to try and move? Come on, come on, move! Move, you bastard! Oh, sleep house sucks. Oh, he's been packaged. I only get one at a time. This is ass. It's still early, so let's try and get some more money quickly. I might be able to handle day five without too much help. Oh boy, it's gonna be a lot. Table for two, please. Absolutely. Right this way, madam. I am at your beck and call. How may I serve you? Appetizer? Yes, yes. Good choice. Hello, welcome. Table for four, please. Of course, you bastards. Please sit here. Thank you, that's all of them. Well, I'm fucking sorry. I really- Oh god, I picked up the wrong thing! Sweet Jesus! Oh, this blows. I had so many dead plates. Clean the table! Oh my god! Please, may I entertain you some? For an extra tip, please. Oh yes, look at me dance. I'm a dancing fiend. Have you ever drank Bailey's out of a shoe? I know you're waiting on more orders. I can only take one plate at a time. I'm very incompetent. But apparently I can roller skate. I can't even roller skate in real life, but this guy can't. But I can tote like three or four plates. I'm aware of what you're waiting on. Shut your mouth. Yes, yes, may I entertain you more? Hello, hello. Yes, welcome to the circus. Thank you so much. Oh, I just barely broke even. It's night time. I feel like I'm gonna get murdered. The noise seems to be coming from the freezer. Yes. Cabinet. I'm still with recipes, tax forms. That's all the budgeting himself. That's a lot of slurping. Man and woman. The woman looks shockingly similar to this. Must be like his mother or his sister. Weeks mean you should promise, however, I couldn't say the same for the service. The staff that have been waiting on my table had been incredibly unprofessional and brash. While this may have been a one-off incident, it was surprising as I am accustomed to the Lagoranda's blah 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 staff being more than professional. 
And I from here it may show a slip in taste and refinement from the hiring process the teacher is known for. It seems to have screwed out the entirety of the notes about the waiter. Is that good? Clean writing is awful. Well used ashtray. Typewriter. Oh yeah, let me go in there. We got a little oogie spooky here. Oh, that was just the amount of you've earned croque madame with flies all over it. Um have I upset you, son? It seems I have I have upset someone. I vanished! I'm invisible. Oh, I'm back. I don't see anybody. We're gonna save. I'll call her. She's not going to answer. Yeah, hey, she's busy. Wow. Why can't I see anything? Oh. Oh, I'm in the oven. <laughs> Ooh, I'm so boned. All right, we're gonna use that. Start that shift. Fresh lemon tart. It let me survive after that. Easy mode. Will she answer this time? Come on, answer the phone, please. I'm lonely. Bro, she's always gonna be busy. She does not like you. I make money today. Two hundred seventy-five. Oh god. I'm getting freaking bullied at this place. I'm gonna get fired. Oh. 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 He thinks I'm tasty. He's so gonna eat me. Let's get the spread. I am so violently ready. Ah, yes, I hope you enjoy your meal. Now please get the fuck out. Please! Don't you see the panic in my eyes? You're not safe here! We're all on the menu! Yes, I'm just cleaning the table. You have a great day. Oh my god, this is freaking stressful. I quit. Pardon? I quit. I, uh, I guess this is a temporary replacement for someone, remember? I know I'm supposed to give you my two weeks, but you've been seeming pretty antsy and upright lately, so you're probably wanting someone more qualified for the position. Well, the position's still available if you need. You sounded fairly desperate when you first asked to work here. Yeah, and now you don't need to worry about it anymore. Huh? Do you like the meal at least? Huh? The the leftovers. Oh, I'll eat the rest tonight for sure. It's pretty bitter though. Right. <sighs> Have a good night, Ready. You too, boss. I just quit my job. This should be enough. 
what do you mean, Lejvina? Hey, man, and I, I know you said we should uh, take a break and all, but I was thinking maybe we could get dinner somewhere. Your choice. I wanted to say sorry, and your call cannot be connected as please call again or try again later. Goodbye. Uh -huh. She changed her number probably because I have called her every. Hey, hey, man, and hey, I tried to call earlier, but I don't think you were at the phone. I was wondering if you wanted to get dinner. Super casual, but we can go anywhere you want. Money is no problem for me, so... Your call cannot be connected. Please call again, or try again later. Goodbye. Bro, are you about to... Man, hello? I, I need to know if you'd want anything to eat. To, to eat anything. I want to get dinner with you if this if it's alright. Try again later. L listen, I... Forget the dinner. Can I... Can I just hear your voice? You haven't picked up the phone even once the past week and I'm... I just need to know you're there. Bro is losing it. Goodbye. Oh, so I guess that's the ending I get if I call her every single day. That's really freaking depressing. <laughs> You've earned the grilled hanga steak. That's all I got for this one. Uh... If you all like this, I'll try and get another ending for Dead Plate. It, it is chaos, and it causes me great anxiety, and suffering, and rage. It's, it's delightful.